Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to give you guys another demo on this Fender's Refetting Pool Pedal. If you haven't watched my previous videos, this is a combination of the Marina Rework and the Mira Unit Delay Pedal. So you can either choose to have them at the same time or just use one of them. So that is the awesome part of this pedal. Uh, on my previous video, I have already shown you guys how this pedal sounds using a Stratcaster, well, Silver Sky. So today, I'm just gonna show you guys how this pedal sounds with a power guitar. So because it's a power guitar, it, you do keep in mind that it is a little bit it's gonna sound a little bit different than a full body acoustic guitar so it may not resonate as much but because this comes with a fisherman pickup so that we are basically really trying to test out how the fisherman guitar sounds on this PLS SE parlor guitar. I think it's called P20E because E stands for electric. P stands for parlor. I'm not exactly sure what 20 is. I'm assuming 20 is, is 2020 because that is the year when this guitar uh, I guess either produced or the time when they start selling it. So without further ado, let's hear how this guitar sounds with the rear part of this pedal. So this guitar is put into a Vox 2M, so it doesn't come with any preset, it is as low a gain as possible because without turning it on to 9 or more or higher, there will be no volume. So that is the downside of Vox, but anyway, this is how this sounds without the pedal. And now we're going to turn on the reverb. And if you have a chance to look for the menu of this guitar and so forth, you can see that um, this Viva pedal comes with the whole room and special, but because it is a parlor guitar, you don't kind of expect too much effect. So I will be just focusing on the hall and the room pedal. Uh, the, I mean the Viva part of it. So now uh, this is currently a hall a small hall effect. And finally, the big hall effect. Okay, now I'm gonna turn it to room. Going back to small room only. And then middle room. And then finally, the big room. OK, 
Okay, so that is the viewer part of this and I'm gonna add some delay by yourself so let, let's hear how it sounds with a little bit of delay I'm gonna do it on the digital at 75 percent um, I try just basic really basic uh, setting so because like I said before I think a power guitar is quite different than a electric electric guitar you kind of you don't need too much effect so basically the digital only wait okay and then the enter lock just once just one setting. And finally, just the uh, echo tag tap. Okay, so that's all that. And then going back, just how this sounds regularly. So now no pedal, just sounds. the end of this demo basically i'm just letting you guys know uh, how this guitar sounds with the reverb the delay to me i think is really unnecessary depending well of course unless you want to do some particular style some kind of special effect then the delay part might be or may be useful for you uh, so to me i don't think this uh oh also i just want to let you guys know this parlor guitar even uh, it, it comes with the Fishman pickup, so you kind of you also have the PA soul effect of it. So it does sound a little bit quite weird with this reverb. Uh, I mean, even now when I'm talking, I, I you actually let me see. Even if I'm talking right now, the I don't know if you can hear it, but the speakers actually picking up. From my voice so this as you can see this is a piezo pickup so it's kind of some it might have some background noise that might affect the pedal and the stuff and that there's some noise that you probably do not want uh, but for just very basic or just want some a little bit real well I think that this pedal is okay but however like I said before yeah you don't need this kind of this kind of pedal because this pedal is so compact at the same time it is so uh, so much stuff going on there it's kind of overkill if you just want to use this on a an acoustic guitar let alone a parlor guitar so uh, I would I mean it's a bonus for me since I have other guitar as well but if you only use or learn guitar or play guitar with a acoustic or parlor I'm sure that you can find all the reverb pedal for you I just don't think this is a suitable pedal for you guys uh, of course if you really want it I mean it's, it's still useful it's just like quite expensive I think it's quite lots of the function will not be suitable for the parlor or the acoustic guitar otherwise it's still a very good pedal it's still very versatile and it still sound great I really like the reverb sound of it but you just but uh, I think acoustic I think and also as a Fender um, reverb you can they do have lots of popular reverb types such as the spring such as the play reverb which this pedal doesn't have so and I think that those actually sound much better on an acoustic or a parlor guitar so I would definitely prefer to spend less uh, on or maybe a little bit more I, I'm not sure what kind of Fender pedal they have nowadays uh, because they, they came up with so many more pedals the past two years so I kind of keep uh, losing track because also the problem is that the, the way how they name the pedal is kind of like 
complicated. It's, I mean, it's cool that they come with different cool color, but sometimes the name is, isn't really help you to sell. So give and set, give or take. Um, I think that if you really want like the Fender kind of viewer stuff, I would might just suggest you to buy an M with all those preset, all those tire stuff. It's also maybe even cheaper to get a pedal. Or you can find like electro harmonic or all the stuff that all the viewer that is much more suitable for the acoustic or part of guitar. But regardless, like I said before, it is I mean if you have one it's not it's not like i mean you still win you know in this case it's, a, it's still a win-win situation it's just that you may as well get an electric guitar as well so i hope you guys find this video useful and um let me know if you guys want to if you want me to try all the stuff on this pedal with all the type of guitar um i don't have time the past few days but maybe next week i will start recording more stuff on using the pedal with the humbucker guitar because like i said before i only test out a good demo on the single coil guitar so on next time i'm probably gonna use it as well on a prs se hollow body 2 piezo guitar so that you can hear how the guitar sound by those two electric pickups as well as piezo itself and also piezo and electric pickup combined so you guys have like much more uh, more kind of like sounds that you can hear and how if those are suitable with this kind of pedal uh, however unlike my previous video i definitely not going to make it too complicated i'm not going to mix everything just like last time because it just get to a point that it's just very frustrated for me so uh but however i would i do definitely cover the reverb part especially the reverb part because to me the delay doesn't really do much for me but uh, i would do some pair one and combination for you guys to hear so in the meantime i hope you guys have a nice weekend and i will see you guys next time. Bye guys!